Hello guys, today I will be teaching you how to log in to a uh, website using Python and also how to uh, create a uh, very simple uh, brute force program that you can use to uh, log into websites as well. So uh, the first step is going to be to install the module called mechanical soup which uh, makes uh, this whole process really easy. So uh, just open a terminal and do pip3 install mechanical soup. But uh, as you can see, I've already installed it. Now, after that, the first line in the code should just be import mechanical soup. Because you want to import that module so you can use, uh, so you can use it. And then we'll uh, create a, uh, a uh, browser object using the stateful browser that comes with uh, mechanical soup which is um, a kind of browser you can use with Python that can uh, uh, that you can control very easily you know to open websites print out which site you're on and log into forms and stuff like that and then we will uh, go to the uh, web page that we are trying to log into. So in my case, I've created just a uh, demonable web application on my localhost network, just for simplicity's sake. So do browser dot open and then the URL to the site you're going to uh, to open. Just to show that this is working, you can uh, print uh, the the URL like this just make sure that this is worth working and you can see when I print a current URL we get the uh, expected uh, expected page so everything's going going well so far I recommend doing a small checks like uh, like this uh, when you're creating your programs now uh, the next step will be to fill out uh, fill out the form so fill in the username fill in the password and the way we do that is uh, first by selecting which form we are going to fill out so uh, just never mind all, all of this just uh, inspect the username highlight it and do inspect then you see uh, we're going to search for a, a form name and uh, or a form so uh, in the code you're going to do browser dot select form and uh, you, you have to identify uh, which form it is and you can do that by uh, the form with where action equals login dot php uh, action equals login You have to do uh, okay like this. Wait, wait, wait. You okay, cut that out. Okay, so the next step is to um, fill in the form. The next step is to fill in the form. Now first we have to select which form we're going to fill in. in. So the way you find it out is by highlighting uh, either the username or password field to inspect in Chrome or Firefox. And uh, you try to look for um, which form this is. And uh, we can identify this form by the action here. So where action equals login dot PHP that's the form we are we are going to fill in so in the code do browser select form and form where action equals login dot PHP there and uh, then you're going to look for uh, 
what the names of these uh, fields that you're gonna fill in are called. So uh, the username, you can see that the name equals username, all lowercase, and uh, the password, the name equals password. So to fi fill this in, you do browser username and you set it to the username you're using and browser password password to the password you're using and in my case my username is admin and my password is password like that then we um, the next thing we're going to do is to submit this form to click press the login button and the way you do that is you do browser submit selected and to check if uh, you log in successfully we can print out the uh, current url which should now have changed to uh, a different page since we have logged in so we can check that and right here we have Okay, I just did a small tackle here. And you can see here that we have changed from uh, the login page to the index page, which means that we managed to log in successfully. We're now reached this page. I'm gonna split this uh, video into two parts where in the next part I'm uh, gonna show you how to uh, do the brute force attack on the damn vulnerable web application using the same uh, methods as we used to log into the page so uh, if you want to see that then uh, you can click the link uh, down here and uh, yeah make sure to leave uh, leave a comment if you need help with anything at all. Thanks for watching. Bye.